Ja Morant has only been in the NBA for four years, but he has already left his mark. Morant blows by Primo, attack! Being named Rookie of the Year, Most Improved Player, and a two-time NBA All-Star, he has quickly become one of the most recognizable players due to his extremely viral plays and his unique athleticism. This has allowed us to get to know more about his personal life, but there are a few things I bet you didn't know about him such as the fact that his college discovered him accidentally, or that he played in the same AAU team as Zion. Keep watching to find out 10 things you surely did not know about Jamorant. On January 21st, 2022, Jamorant ranked 7th on the NBA's hottest selling jersey list out of elite players such as Joel Embiid or even Damian Lillard. This summer, he signed a $200 million rookie maximum contract extension with the Grizzlies, even though he was probably desired by every other team in the league. However, he hasn't always been as popular as he is nowadays, as back in high school, he was discovered by Murray State accidentally. That's right, James Kane, who at the time was Murray State's basketball assistant coach, was checking out a popular player who was participating in a tournament, when he got hungry and went to buy some Doritos nearby. From there, he heard another high school basketball match going on in a different court, and he went to check it out. Here, he focused on observing an unranked guard who was noticeably faster than everyone else. He said, just a few minutes of watching Ja, you just knew he was special. And from there, the rest is history. Now, we have to give props to James Kane's recruiting abilities, because Ja's career at Murray State did not go unnoticed. He helped lead Murray State to get to the NCAA tournament in both of his seasons there, and he even led the team when they upset fifth-seeded Marquette in the opening round of the 2019 edition of March Madness. As a result of this incredible performance during these seasons, Murray State retired his number 12 jersey at a ceremony back in 2020. But even before being noticed by Murray State, he had already played in the same AAU team with Zion. These tournaments are made to give young players an opportunity to compete on local and regional tournaments outside of their school teams, which allowed these two NBA superstars to meet each other almost a decade ago. Zion's performance became viral and took the spotlight away from Ja, but this experience made them become close friends and they have continued to support each other as they both entered the NBA. Ja was not able to dunk until his senior year of high school. Before he got to college, he would describe himself as a short and slow guard that would almost never attack the rim. However, nowadays he is known for his scoring ability, memorable high-flying dunks, and electric plays on both sides of the floor, which makes some people compare him to Derrick Rose or even prime Russell Westbrook. But I'm honestly not sure we can compare Ja to anyone that has ever played, since in his first two playoff appearances, he already broke several records. He scored 47 points in a game, becoming the most points scored by a Grizzly in a playoff game, and the fourth youngest player to score 40 in the playoffs after Magic Johnson, LeBron James, and Luka Doncic. In this game, he also set the record for the most points in a playoff game by a player under 21, and he did this all in his first time in the playoffs. He's unstoppable. During his rookie season, he averaged almost 18 points, 7 assists, and 4 rebounds per game. Morant was named Rookie of the Year as he received 99 first place votes out of the 100 possible ones, beating Kendrick Nunn and Zion Williamson to the accomplishment. As a consequence, South Carolina went on to create a new holiday called Ja Morant Day on August 10th, which is actually his birthday. In his fourth NBA season, Morant became just the fifth active player to have his own signature sneaker with Nike along with Giannis Antetokounmpo, LeBron James, Kevin Durant, and Paul George. On Christmas morning, the Grizzly star announced the arrival of his signature Nike sneakers, called the Ja One, on his social media by stating, the grind starts on day one. He's really living the dream. Morant's father, T. Morant, coached him at the start of his career as he knew what it took to make it to the next level. Having played basketball at Claflin University and narrowly missing making an NBA roster, he made it his mission to get Ja to the NBA. T played high school basketball alongside Ray Allen at Hillcrest High, and even started a basketball career overseas. However, 
His professional aspirations were cut short when he found out his wife was pregnant with Ja, where he decided to return home and become a barber in order to support his family. Ja Moran's parents raised him in a warm, supportive home environment, which has helped him become who he is today. He will forever be grateful to his parents, and even took his whole family to Memphis to live with him when he got drafted. Nowadays, Ja and his parents are next door neighbors as he says, I don't know where I would be without them. The same year he got drafted and moved with his whole family to Memphis, he welcomed a daughter with his former girlfriend KK Dixon. She is now three years old and is known to enjoy watching Ja play. She can even be considered his own personal cheerleader. Here, you can see her celebrating a playoffs win by the Grizzlies, dancing just like his father Ja. These were just some interesting facts about Ja Morant that you probably did not know. From his accidental discovery by Murray State to his impressive playoff debut, there is no doubt that Ja is a rising star in the NBA and that he will keep entertaining us for years to come. Did I miss any other interesting facts? If so, leave them down in the comments. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe.